It's like, no. Instant assessment. You're a fucking huge pussy. Okay, same thing here. Do you want to learn like a like a real alpha male? There's like this like rising intonation in their voice. What's up guys, John Anthony here from John Anthony Lifestyle. Today we're gonna to look at the internet marketing scammer who goes by 33 Secrets, okay, otherwise known as Matt Cross. We're gonna look at a video that another guy did on him and look at how fucking cringe and bullshit it is. I've heard from a variety of circles that Matt Cross is just an internet marketer that came into the space just to fucking make money. What a surprise. Wah, wah, wah. Okay, and has buddies with all the rest of the fucking scammers in the red pill space, including Rolo fucking loser Tomasi, okay? So, let's jump into that. But before we begin, if you're new to the channel, please subscribe below, press the notification bell for alerts of two new videos a day. Also, if you are done fucking around with the endless amounts of scammers in the dating space and you want to get actual results and actually solve the problem permanently, you can jump on a free 30 minute call with the link in the description and we'll show you how we can get you very good very fast, okay? And solve all your problems in the dating game. Okay, so here we go, let's jump right in. Guys, I've got a confession to make. I am a beta male. When I'm getting sushi and they ask me if I want soy sauce, I say yes. But today, today is the day that I'm gonna turn all that around because today is the day that this dude teaches me to become an alpha male, that's right, okay? I'm blessed. It's some dude called Alpha Male Secrets. Yeah, he was before Alpha Male Secrets, and you'll see in here 44 Secrets or some fucking bullshit, and now in the modern day 33 Secrets. It's just stupid fucking bullshit. Internet marketing terminology. Oh, we're gonna give you the secret hack, the secret uh, trick, one little trick, one little secret. Yeah, okay, just fucking bullshit. And he's one of those guys who does videos to promote a course that they're doing where it's like, hey, Pay twenty dollars a month, and I'll teach you how to get get so many women, bro, like that kind of thing. And so we're just going to begin with this video: how to order food like an alpha male. And yeah, those dudes, like the whole, all these scammers give the fucking niche a terrible name. Okay, there is this the pickup and seduction game is a skill game. It is full of strategy and tactics. Okay, and it does work when you're doing it properly. The thing is that 99% of the fucking coaches are full of shit. They're just going for a money grab. They're just there to talk the talk and, and they don't walk the walk ever. Okay, that's why they don't have any receipts. That's why they don't have any infields. That's why they don't have any testimonials of any kind of, you know, real testimonials of any good sort. But they're there to make money and then it makes the whole fucking industry look bad because they're fucking corny and they obviously have no idea what they're talking about. Uh, one, one simple trick, I don't think most... Do most people approach life that way? You're ordering a fillet of fish, not... <laughs> like, you don't need to prove to the cashier how much of a man you are. This is when he was the 44 secrets, okay? Now it's 33, making it a little bit easier to digest for everyone, thanks. Right, so he begins all his videos with this image, presumably to prove what a slayer he is, but he just looks kind of lost. <laughs> What's funny too is like, look at this chick here. What is that, a, a four? Okay, this chick's got like a weird overbite thing going on. It's fucking highlighted tips. Uh, someone fucking killing, like, it's like Matt Artisan's brother. Presumably to prove what a slayer he is, but he just looks kind of lost, like, are you okay? This is just me when I was younger and I got lost at like a grocery store or something. Yeah, he probably thought this woman was his mum because she has a similar hairstyle. Hey, this is M from Alpha Male Secrets and in this new secret training- This is so fucking cringe. Like, this is not how any alpha dude would ever talk. He's just an internet marketer. Look, he's reading off something over on the side. This is M, and in this one simple video, I'm gonna show you how I can steal your money without you realizing what I'm doing. Video, I'm going to show you one secret trick for how to order your food like an alpha male, a real alpha male. Yeah, you. this is how Corey Wayne talks. I just fucking, I just saw the connection. Do you guys wanna learn how you can be one? It's like, no. Instant assessment. You're a fucking huge pussy. Okay, same thing here. Do you want to learn like a like a real alpha male? There's like this like rising intonation in their voice. Permission seeking. 
Okay, total fucking corny. It, anyone that's really alpha can see right through this instantly. Okay, and guys always in the comments. A uh, real alpha wouldn't say he's really out. A real alpha would do whatever the fuck he wants, okay? Because he doesn't give a shit. And I don't need anyone in the comments to, to verify if I am or not, okay? I have, I have plenty of hot women that I've banged all around the world that have uh, some independent verification on their own, okay? And not a beta male. Right, so firstly, <laughs> it's a secret video, is it? It's not a secret video, it's up on YouTube. And like... Who cares, right? Who cares? Like, do you want to be that dude? Just never shows a sign of weakness, walks up to the counter, Hey, I love two number nines. Cough. And second, it's nighttime. Take off your glasses, you fucking clown. They're not that cool. They're not that alpha. I mean, it's kind of a sign of weakness. Like, are, are your retina is really that weak? Because this is something that we as guys do every single day. At least most of us. Unless you're one of those rare homebodies who stocks up on food at home. What the fuck is he even talking about? I wish, like, the internet fucking sucks in a lot of ways, okay? Because you can have total retards come on and trick everyone that they know shit about a certain skill, okay? You wouldn't be able to have a basketball player or a UFC fighter just go on YouTube and tell you how great they are at basketball and, and fighting without ever showing you or without ever proving it, okay? But in the dating space... That's exactly what all these fuckers do. I'm going to show you one simple trick and one simple secret about how you will think that I'm the man and hand over all your money, bro. It's like, it's absolutely insane. Okay, the, where's, where's all these fuckers in field footage? Where's, where's their fucking receipts? It's nowhere. They don't have it. They, these guys fucking suck. And they trick tons of people. It's maddening. This, just watch this, it's fucking maddening. And never goes out. But if you're like most guys, most guys do in fact order food at least once a day, oh whether you're in a restaurant, on a date, or- He's, he's talking, ex <laughs> he's talking exactly like Corey Wayne. Exactly like a huge, massive fucking pussy loser would talk. Or okay, we- we don't need to know the statistics, you know, Ben Shapiro, okay? You can move on. Now, when most guys order their food, they generally ask for permission to order. They come from that low status beta male frame and ask for permission to buy their meal. Hey, can I take your order? Yeah, can I get a single, just the hamburger? No cheese, right? Uh, can I get cheese on that as well? You don't want the cheese? No, can I get cheese? A what? The fuck is even going on here? Can I get cheese? Are you saying can I get cheese? Yes. It comes with cheese. Okay. Uh, can I also get extra lettuce and extra tomatoes? Okay. See what I mean? <laughs> oh, I fucking hate this guy. Basically, ask for permission to order their food. Right, okay, I want to talk about this interaction. Right, so what he's saying is that what most guys do is they ask for permission to order. They say, Can I have a burger? rather than give me burger. But then he acts as if this conversation was made awkward by him asking for permission. No, it's made awkward by awkward conversational skills. That's. It's not, it's not the, can I? Yeah, exactly. He was acting like a total fucking weirdo the whole time. At the beginning of the sentence that makes it weird, it's the sentence. Whatever, who cares, let's keep going. And I see countless guys out there making this mistake every single day. Every time I go out to get food, matter of fact. Whether I'm in a restaurant, on a date myself, or just stopping at some fast food chain. And if this is you, this is a really, really bad habit that you want to break, like right now. And like I said, it's a really small <laughs> yet subtle behavioral <laughs> pattern that does make a huge impact uh, on how well people treat you or how piss poor people treat you. Okay, so if, is that true? Is saying, hey, I'll have the special really any better than can I get the special? Like, no, I get that there might be some <laughs> psychological difference, right? But I don't think it's as important as you're making it out to be, dude. Like, what, girls are just here listening in on you ordering a meal? <laughs> oh, he said, can I get a burger? 
No fucking him. And I'd also like an ice water. Something else for you? No, that's it. You see the difference? Okay, so it's <laughs> it's it's a tutorial on how to order a burger from McDonald's. Thank you. This is what the world needed. Thank you so much. Hey, can I get a Fortnite burger? No, that's not how you say it. You have to say, I'll get a Fortnite burger. So until next time, this is M from Alpha Male Secrets. And if you enjoyed what you just learned in this new secret training video, then don't forget to add yourself. Secret training video. Internet marketer alert. Off to my priority waiting list. <laughs> and I'm not saying there's nothing to what he's saying. Like, yes, be confident. Yes, that's generally a more attractive quality. Yes, true. It's a bit weird when you just, you know, burger now. Like, <laughs> it's weird when you overcompensate is all I'm saying. And like, what kind of guy goes and buys a course on how to be an alpha male? Like, Especially from this clown. Right, so now let's move on to a more viewed video of his. It's called Top 10 Alpha Male Body Language Secrets That Attract Women Like Crazy. Do not watch. We're not allowed. Okay, next video. Hey, this is M from Alpha Male Secrets. And in this new... Okay, I gotta stop you right there. I'm noticing the, you know, the top couple buttons undone. You're... <laughs> yeah, he's, the, he's that guy. Yeah, he's that dude. He walks like this. Makes uncomfortable eye contact with you. You'll be the one to look down. You'll be the one to submit. <laughs> Can I get a big man? Shut the f up. <laughs> okay, you listen here. You listen up here. Hey, this is M from Alpha Male Secrets, and in this new secret training video, you're about to learn my top seven body language secrets that attracts beautiful women like crazy. More importantly, these top seven body language secrets that I'm about to teach you will literally turn you from a weak, spineless beta male into a strong, confident alpha male literally overnight. Uh, is that true? N not, not really, is it? Right, so these couple tips from this dude are gonna <laughs> turn like the most soy infested, <laughs> like bowed shoulders, doesn't make eye contact with you, into some huge Beast of a man, some Goku, you know, <laughs> some ooh, give me a, a large Angus, please. Right, and, and he also made this whole video where where he said to be an alpha male, you have to stop watching movies. Hey, this is M from Alpha Male <laughs> Secrets, coming to you live from Hollywood, California, <laughs> and in this new secret training video, you're about to learn. Why Do you guys see the pattern here? Okay, for those of you that watch Matt Cross, 33 Secrets in the Modern Day, what a fucking idiot, okay? Hi, this is M. In this new secret training video, I'm going to teach you to stop watching movies. If you want to be an alpha male overnight, just sign up for my shit. It's like Corey Wayne where he's like, hi, I'm Corey Wayne, blah, 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 blah. Do you want to get more hot women in your life? It's like... Congratulations, you've tricked everyone. Congratulations, you guys got hundreds of thousands of subs masquerading as the cool guys, okay, and just running marketing fucking bullshit 101. Nice work. Good job. Hooray for the internet, okay? And then guys will come to me, hey, uh, if your shit really was so good, why don't you have more subs? Uh, all the best guys in the, the game that I know don't even have channels, okay? I'm like the rogue one just because I love the game so much that fucking just you know, relentlessly puts out endlessly uh, good content that's practical and straightforward and efficient and effective that actually gets guys really good. And then you have this shit, okay, the, all the rest of the fucking noise that pollutes the fucking community, that, that wrecks these guys' minds. I can't tell you guys the number of times I've had guys go and, like, talk to every coach in the space, literally. And they're like, dude, the authenticity you bring to the table is here compared to these guys. Like, night and day difference. I'm trying to just do this for the camera here. But it, it would way be, it would be off the screen, off the charts. They're like, you definitively know what you're talking about. I can see it. These other guys, their bullshit meter goes off like through the roof. Okay. Why is that? Is it, is it just a coincidence that I also happen to have the most proof, more proof than the rest of the industry combined? Okay. No, it's not a coincidence. I have thousands of pictures and hookup situations, hundreds of hours of infields, endless testimonials, and churning out guys that get ultra good. Then you have the internet marketers that don't fucking help you at all.
Okay, yeah, they're just there to take your money and tell you to stop watching movies. Okay, and by the way, jump on that fucking call in the description if you want to get better. It's that simple. A lot of people are the guys emailing they're like, "Oh, I love your content. I'm not sure if I should, uh, hear, you know, get on a call." About why? Just fucking hear the details of the program and how we can help you. And it's very, it's very straightforward. So. Stop wasting your time with this kind of nonsense with these guys. If you want to become a real alpha male these days, the first thing you must, must do is you must, must stop watching movies and television shows that are being produced by Hollywood these days. That's kind of a bit of a trade-off, but sure, let's see. Why? because nearly every movie and every television show being produced by Hollywood these days are no longer being produced to entertain you, but to indoctrinate you, taking you from alpha male right back down to beta male. Nearly every movie and every television show that you watch <laughs> these days is in fact injected with some form of anti-male, emasculated, feminist view aimed not at entertaining you, but indoctrinating you. Indoctrinating you into adopting feminist ideas and leftist views into your life. <laughs> what? Just one example of this <laughs> is the most recent Mad Max movie, which is supposed to be a male targeted action flick. Yet, it was heavily injected with a ton of feminist propaganda. Okay, now I'm not going to get too political, but I'm just going to give a couple quick thoughts. Um, this don't make no sense. I haven't seen the new Mad Max, so I can't speak on that one. I'm going to get crucified for saying that. But if, like, I've seen a lot of complaining about this, about them trying to brainwash us, and I think it's very conspiratorial, but I really do think that it's just companies attempting to look progressive and get popular opinions on their side rather than brainwash us, turn us into soy boys. I don't think they care about you being an alpha or not. I don't really think they give a f but I think as far as it probably goes is it's kind of a disingenuous way to look progressive, right? I, I don't think it's as big of a deal as you and some others make it out to be. Anyway, that's, that's as political as I'm going to get. That aside, some of the things he says are fine, are true enough, right? Like, Posture, eye contact are important things that make you look confident, but he tries to kind of oversell it. He tries to like, okay guys, so if you do this, everyone is going to love you. Like, no, you just want to sell your little package. And I'm guessing it appeals to fairly insecure young guys. So yeah, I'll be signing up today. Yeah, so that's that. Anyway, I'm going to be putting what I've learned today to the test. So um, smash like, comment, subscribe, okay? I'm not going to... I'm, I'm not asking, okay? Follow me on Instagram. Follow me on Twitter. Grr. Yeah. So, I'll do more follow-up videos on fucking idiot Matt Cross. I gotta email the whole bunch of shit. And I, I just want to do this separate video here where I'm looking at this guy's look at some of his earlier days when he was, you know, not broken out of his internet marketing uh, acting yet. Uh, if you want to be an alpha male, uh, make sure you sign up for the thing and I will teach you how to get better, right? I, so many guys have emailed me saying that, that he they like traced his, his pathway. He just came into the space to make money. And if you can't figure that out from hearing uh, this one sim simple trick, this secret video, all the, get the fuck out of here, okay? Uh, anyways, that was fun. Let me know what you guys think in the comments. Please like, comment, and share. Subscribe below, notification bell for two new videos a day. Pick up content plus reaction videos. Uh, it's, it's, it's like a losing battle against all these fucking assholes in the industry. And then they'll all retaliate and slander me all over online and I have to fucking sue them and shit. It's a fun life. Um, also, if you are ready for the real solution, if you're done fucking around with these guys, you know where to turn. Jump on that free 30 minute call. We'll sort you out very quickly and you don't have to watch any fucking videos anymore. Not even mine. Okay, unless you just want to get a laugh. So thank you guys and I'll see you on the next video. Take care. And Jay don't stand in line. I ain't never had to wait. I'm the realest in this game. I ain't never had to fake. Just take a look at the scores. I put numbers up on the boards. I'm in a section with models and you're at the bar trying to get out of cluster of fours. Fixture, I'm a factor, I'm a boss tycoon My dick smell like two chicks before noon